Hey, what's up guys? You boys, Twilight 2K7, and we are back for a brand new Grand Theft 5 real life mod video. Today, we're starting out at our construction company here in Los Santos, and we're actually going to head up in a convoy towards Sandy Shores so that we could do some work on our towing company up there. So, we have two cement trucks. Um, like I was telling you guys for the past couple of weeks, we're going to do some upgrades at the shop. So, you guys know we have like a dirt like we have dirt on the ground at the shop and sometimes some of the trucks like slip in there it gets kind of crazy so what we're gonna do is lay down concrete so we got two cement trucks for the concrete we also have two of the cherry pickers we're actually going to do some work on top of the roofs as well and we're going to increase the size of the garage so we're going to definitely need the cherry pickers we have the boxville coming as well just to bring some extra ladders and equipment. And then we also have the site supervisor F350. He's pretty much gonna oversee the whole operation and make sure that all of the construction is going as planned. Since obviously we're busy, we're not gonna be there the whole time. We may have to do some towing. We may have to uh, stop by one of our dealerships. You guys already know we're like super busy. So anyway, we do have a brand new truck. This is the 2020 GMC Denali. HD dually and we have it hooked up and ready to go we're actually going to be towing a trailer and the trailer is a little bit overweight but I think this truck could handle it let me know in the comment section what you guys think but this truck looks amazing this is by bag custom so huge shout outs to bag for another amazing release you guys know I do love the duallys and it's nice to see a GMC dually I mean we did have a 2018 um, but this one I mean, it's a 2020. It's better. <laughs> it is better. Oh, yeah, this is a Sierra. I forgot about that. GMC Sierra and the Denali. I forgot they, they kind of call it both. But, yeah, this is really cool. We got the uh, attachment in there so we could tow our trailer. Very nice. Got the tow mirrors. I actually love the front of this truck, too. It looks really nice. Which one do you guys think looks better, the Chevy version or the GMC? But or the GMC version. I think the GMC looks slightly better, but I do like both. Like these heavy-duty wheels in the front as well. That is really nice. This has a lot of detail. So I'm very happy we got this truck. Like I said, we did have a 2018 version. Some of you guys may remember it, but this was definitely a nice upgrade for our construction series. And if you guys would like to get this truck early. You, go, you could check it out on Bag Customs Patreon page, and I will link it down below. And if you guys don't know, he does release all of his mods on Patreon, and you get them early, like up to a month early on Patreon before they hit, um, before they go public, basically. So, all right, looking good, looking good. Interior is nice. I actually saw somebody do something. Uh, Oh, there we go. So I changed my post FX to normal. So now you guys can kind of see the dials and all the details and stuff. It's not too bright. I think I was watching one of Nuke's videos and he did that. And I was like, oh, I didn't even realize I could do that. So whenever we switch back to police, we just turn it back on. And then when we're doing this, we just turn it down and it works. All right, perfect. So let's go ahead and get this attached. So we're going to back up. Oh, this thing has a lot of power. I think I may turn it back up a little bit because it looks like it dulled out the outside lights a little too much. Alright, so we got the tailgate down. Let's go ahead and connect. There we go. And let's just take a look at the load, make sure everything's secured. Like I said, we're hauling a little heavy today, or rolling a little heavy today, but I think this truck can handle it. So we have a steamroller that's going to help with uh, laying the concrete or flattening out the concrete. We have a skid steer just for general moving stuff around and leveling out the ground. The ground is pretty level, so I don't think we're going to have to do too much work, but we'll see once we get there. All right, we are ready. Everything's chained down. Let's get going. Alright, so let's get going. It's going to be a heavy load for us, but like I said, 
I think our truck could handle it. Alright, it's going to be a little bit hard to get out of here. But I think we could get it. Just got to cut this turn well. Oh, that is extremely close. But we got it. Alright, so let's uh, let the convoy get going and let's get the heck up out of here, guys. Alright, so we are moving. Alright, so we got about four miles on the freeway. Are you serious? I hate the GPS. The GPS is making him take the streets, even though we could just get right onto the freeway and stay on the freeway. You gotta be kidding me. He literally got off for no reason and he's gonna get right back on. Alright, that's what it is. Okay guys, I had to reset us onto the highway because he was taking some crazy detour. He was turning over there. I don't know what was going on. I should have just made them follow me. It's going to be cool now that our construction company grew so much. You guys are going to see a lot of our construction vehicles all on the road like that semi-truck. Oh, two semi-trucks. One's hauling a flatbed and one's just a semi-truck. So here, here they are kind of dumb again. We could have stayed on the freeway, but the GPS makes you get off the freeway just to get right back onto the freeway. <laughs> it makes no sense, but we could have just stayed right on and went right around. Excuse me. There goes another one of our semis. Alright, coming up on our halfway point of two miles.
<laughs> that was really close. We almost wrecked a new truck. Alright, we have sandy shores in sight, so we are almost there. Uh oh. We need to just stay in one lane. Right? Oh! What the? I know I drive crazy too, but come on. At least I don't hit other cars. Dude, just. Cut us off and slammed on his brakes. Okay, we're gonna be getting off here in Sandy Shores. Oh my god, that cement truck is not gonna make it. Ay, ay, ay. Cut off everybody there at the last second. Oh my god, I just realized none of them made the turn. Are you serious? All right, guys, so we made it up to our tow company, Ace Towing. I already had all of the guys pull out all of our tow trucks so that we could go ahead and get to work. So all of the tow trucks are parked outside today. So I'm just going to bring the vehicles in just because they have a hard time driving through here since this is like an add-on map and everything. So we'll bring this in here. Oh, this car has no sound file. Wow, I got to fix that. That is so weird. Okay, so let me just give you guys a quick run through of what we're going to be doing. So the main improvement, like I was saying, is going to be putting down concrete pavement. So this side of the shop is already paved with concrete, but sometimes when the trucks come in, especially when it's raining or if it's like really dry out here, or if we got to spin around a truck and trailer, like it gets crazy and they start slipping and sliding. So we're going to put concrete all over here. We're also going to expand this garage over here and start doing more work here. So this is going to get lifted up and get raised and get improved. And we're going to also, oh, I'm sorry. We're also make a couple other minor changes. So we have the construction company here. They're going to be here for probably going to take them. I'm well, actually not too sure. A couple of days to a week to get all of the work done. And um, then we'll be ready to go. So the tow truck company, they're still going to be operating, but we're basically just going to have to, you know, unfortunately park our cars outside and we're just going to have to make sure that we have our cameras over on the cars and we also just keep somebody out in the yard watching the cars and watching any cars that we towed to make sure that they're all safe. But yeah guys, so we go ahead and get to work. Just going to bring a couple of these trucks in. And once we get everything done, I'll give you guys another update and show you guys how the shop looks. So I actually thought the garage was much higher. <laughs> we really don't even need these cherry pickers, but we'll, we'll still bring them. And they're really cool. I'm going to do a video with these too. Because you can actually put, put up the boom, which is pretty nice. So maybe we'll do like some power line work or something like that.
going up. That is so cool. Alright, and uh, yeah guys, so we're going to get to work. Um, we're going to be a little bit busy, like I said. It's going to be a little bit tough running the tow company out of here, but we should be fine. We have plenty of space up here to park cars, and um, we should be fine. But once we get the concrete laid down, we're pretty much ready to go. So that's going to do it for this one, guys. Just going to bring a couple more of these trucks in. But I really do hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, definitely go ahead and hit the like button. Leave some comments down below. If you're new, make sure you subscribe and turn on notifications because we're going to have new videos every single day. And uh, we also live stream a couple times a week as well. I think if I should just leave this out here, I think I am. Because it's really not that much space in there. So let's spin this around. All right, so I'll get this stuff unloaded and we'll bring these in and then we'll call it a day. These tracks get stuck on the trailers sometimes. Oh, I forgot. One of the most important things we're going to add to, guys, is going to be our own uh, gas pump. So we're going to also install a gas pump right here in a gas tank so that we can fill up all of the trucks with diesel or gasoline from right here. So that's going to also be helpful. <laughs> we got like no traction on these trailers. So close, almost made it. <laughs> I keep going the wrong way, like I keep trying to go around this guy. I just noticed this doesn't have any sound either. Gotta check that out. See what that's about. You could, um... Ah, I guess I'll just leave it on this side. Alright, perfect. Alright, so again, that is going to do it for this one, guys. Um, we're going to get all the work done. It's going to take us a couple of days, but we should have it done by the end of the week. So hopefully you guys did enjoy the episode. Again, if you did, please hit that like button. It really helps the video out. And also leave a comment. It lets me know what you guys like, and it gives me feedback and suggestions for future videos as well. So definitely go ahead and leave a comment. And um, subscribe again. If you're not already subscribed, turn on notifications, all that good stuff. Check me out also. You can find me not only on YouTube, but also on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. All at AcePilot2K7 as well. So follow me all over there. And yeah, guys, that's going to do it for this one, guys. So thank you so much for watching. Really do hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.